and anything from Suraj or Athiya that they would like to know about your work? We need to join her, her studio one more. I'm very happy he's coming to Ken's, Ken's Corner because I live right here. So that's like a, I'm super excited for that. But she is still travel to Bandra. Oh yes, well. <laughs> Okay, could kindly share with us also, being as professional on big screens and in the public eyes, celebrity status, how much is that pressure of fitness, how demanding is it now for you? Uh, for me, it's the most important. Uh, I actually started training when I was uh, really young, from my martial arts to my weight training and all of that. Uh, I, would, I would be, uh, I don't know if I'm fit, but I would be as fit as I am right now, even if I would want to be a doctor or something else. I think fitness is the most important uh, aspect of, of for, for anybody and uh, uh, it is it is uh, amazing because it makes you feel uh, so amazing uh, after you see results and it's a never-ending process you keep learning so many things about your own body uh, every every second week so that's a never-ending process and uh, this is something new which I want to try because it's it's really important for you to try uh, new and new ways to work out um, fitness is obviously extremely important I think um for actors especially, because um, you have to look good on screen. But also as um, a person, I think you need to be fit because um, it says a lot about the way, not only how you look, but how you feel, your mind and body have to be in sync. And um, I think what's really important is that you, you don't need to look good for a role, but I think you need to um, be fit generally. And I think that's extremely, extremely important. Um, it's okay if you're skinny, it's okay if you're fat. Um, you just have to feel good about yourself and working out and be healthy and eating healthy. And everybody has different body types. Um, there's no ideal body type. And I think that's very important for people to know that you can be fit in different shapes and sizes. Nasmin, we have been using. That's wonderful. Everyone's accepted as they are. Everyone's invited on the bus. Okay. Yasmin, something about this term and fundamental of Pilates. So could you kindly share with us because it's a much used word and that's the foundation of the book. Uh, my best explanation of Pilates is uh, like Joseph Pilates who's the founder of Pilates used to say, he used to call his work Contrology, which is where you take control of your mind, your mind and your body, you basically have control of your life. And to do that, what he did was he it's like a, he did all kinds of exercises. He was a martial arts uh, man, he was a gymnast, he was a boxer, he did yoga, he did everything. And what I think he did is he put everything in together to create Pilates. And uh, when you do Pilates, I mean, when you read it and you know you hear about it, it's a very Western term right now for our country. It's not going to be because from 10 years back to now, it's changed so much and I can tell you, I can guarantee you that everyone's going to be doing it in the next 10 years. Because it's such a beautiful form of exercise, it gives you strength without injury. It gives you strength without causing any harm. Uh, the weights you do are very gentle on your body, mechanisms. And it's very, very functional. In Pilates, we don't do any movements. Uh, I've done them squats with the barbell, you know, you're doing sumo squats, you're doing the squats. But really, when are you using those squats in life? You know, you're not going to squat your way through your life. And even when you lunge, we lunge straight, whereas functionally, you lunge with rotation. You lunge to reach something. You lunge to, you know, you, you reach up to get something. In the gym, we're very constricted in our movements. Pilates teaches you to do rotation, flexion, you know, stuff like that with resistance. So it's functionally training your body to move in the different directions to the knee surgery. We recuperate them through Pilates. We have people who come back after slip discs. We help them. Pregnancy, we've trained people during pregnancy. My gynac sitting here and nodding her head at me. Uh, Dr. Ranjana Dhanu, thank you for coming. And uh, post-pregnancy, every kind of body. Uh, my most fun is when a man who works out in the gym with really heavy weights and says, hmm, Pilates, okay, let's try it. I'll come into the gym, give me a session, let me see what it feels like. I love it because I make him do the most simple things which require concentration and control and he can't do it. Give him a lot of weight and he can lift it, 
but you are you tweak it a little bit and ask not even flexibility i'm not saying i'm challenging an inflexible person with flexibility i'm just changing the routine a little so yeah it's 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 a great form of exercise for each and every one gentle Gentle is just a nice way of saying it. If you come into my studio, you'll but realize. challenging. Yeah, like like my 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 clients tell me the first two classes, I'm like an angel, and then they see the devil in me. <laughs> okay, we're going to give a very special opportunity for those of you who would like to take from the media an exclusive uh, frame all together. So we'll give you one more opportunity. Uh, Suraj and Atiya have some prior engagement to which they need to progress to. So we need to excuse them, but we're not going to release them without giving them a very special and deserving applaud. So thank you very much on behalf of Crossword and everyone from the publishers, Penguin Random House. Signing. I, I never ever thought in my life that I would be sitting in a uh, bookstore <laughs> signing a book. But this is one book I, can, I, I could be signing for because I've been uh, involved with fitness for a very long time and I'm really happy to uh, know uh, uh, Yasmin now and um, hopefully going to do some fitness session, uh, sessions with her uh, for her for her Pilates class. So there are some bits. Yeah. <laughs> 